Jeez, that paper is thick. That paper thick. Hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. <laughs> What's up, rascals? Welcome back to Polymericum, and uh, we're still in the dollhouse, and I'm still trying to fight off that accent. <laughs> uh, but we're about to try and see if there's any reason to go into this maze, and if that's where we need to go, maybe... Oh, hello. Maybe... Oh, there's nothing here. Oh. Ah, to Narnia! Or just the rest of the apartment. Cool. What do we do now? Do we run towards the light? Or... What? I have no... Clue which way to go or where to... What to do next. Uh, so... Bear with me. I'm going to find out... One way or another what I am supposed to do or where am I supposed to go she has a separated garage for a a, a car can we drive are we gonna drive what the hell kind of car is this bitch has no taste I need a remote control for this toy car oh Oh, we are gonna drive! I just need to find the remote! Holy shnikey boys! Alright! It's gonna be a little bit weird, but I can dig it! Where is that remote, though? I'm gonna find this ding. Ding? I'm gonna find this remote. Or else we're not gonna get very far. Somewhere around here... Could be... The remote control for that wacky thing. Jeez, that paper is thick. That paper thick. Alright, I think that's where I came from. So yeah. Do we need to go back in the house? You wouldn't happen to have a remote control to your car, would you? I I kinda need it for reasons. Gotta go to the store for some beer and cigarettes. I have a feeling I've overlooked it. And hopefully, I find it. And I don't have to, like, um... What's the thing I'm thinking? Hopefully I don't have to search the entire apartment floor just to find the remote. Cuz that would be stinky. I'll do it, but I won't like it. Aha! Seems to be the controller for the battery car. You mean the remote control car? Same thing, only different. Shut up! You nitpicking so and so. All right, all right, all right. Back to the garage. We gonna go on a joy ride. <laughs> as long as nothing interferes with that by, like, being a big plasticky dick. Ugh, that sounds all kinds of wrong. Oh, oh my. Oh my. This is this is all kinds of weird, and I'm I'm not sure what I'm doing or why I'm doing it. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I don't know what that is. Oh God! I think something's chasing me, and I got to escape. Babsy, don't block the way. I'm running you over, bitch. Ah! All right, into the fence we go. Is this how we escape in a toy car in the vents as a as a minifigure? Could be. I don't know. Maybe we're trying to avoid 
something behind us. I, I don't know, this thing doesn't have a rear view mirror. Or good headlights. Oh, that doesn't sound good at all. Uh, let me go. Let me, let me just keep going and avoid whatever that thing is that I'm hearing. Because it sounds hungry. And I don't think that I want to feed it. Because, you know, never mind. I can't think of a clever double entendre with that. I don't know. Saying that I want to feed it with it, thinking that I'm the food, that, that might be clever. But now I'm, uh, now I'm just over explaining things and making things worse. And shut up, Nate! Okay. This is the weirdest part of any game I've ever played. Literally just traveling through vents in a remote control car to avoid being attacked by sentient plastic brought to life by an an evil ritual. Maybe. Alright, here we go. Where to now? How about this way? Why not? Can I get back to normal size soon, please? I'd like that. Consequences be damned if this thing gets... Oh. Oh. Now it's, now it's out of control. And now the cops are going to be after me for a potential DUI. <laughs> oh. Aha. I kind of figured that was going to happen if, to get me back to normal size. This thing would have to uh, also become big. All right. Where do we go? Where do we go? And what do we do? We just explore. That's that's all there is to it. Hello? Any notes, please? Oh. Okay. No. Nothing in there. What about in there? Nothing. Nada. Zero. Zilch. Zippity doo da. The escaped must return. He is the raven who shows us the way, the way back to the life after. With every agony he suffers, one of us is given freedom. Perhaps his strength would be enough for all of us before he begins his last flight in eternal peace. If he has flown over the mountain, we will return to the source where it will receive him. What we have done to nature will never be forgotten. No one knows what awaits us. Whatever it will be, we deserve it. What kind of symbolic hoopla are you spewing, sir? Also, what? That sounds absolutely whack. But it's just more the same if you're really paying attention to all of it. These people have lost their minds and, uh... Uh, it's not pretty. Also, I think I'm lost. I think I got turned around. Oh, maybe not. But still, hmm, okay. I guess I'm going the right way, sort of, kind of. Eventually. Wait, do I want to drop down there? Is that what I'm supposed to do? That... Doesn't seem safe. You know what? This all could be just a total trick of the mind. I don't know. Hmm. I don't want to drop down because that might not be. I don't. Where else would I go, though? Well, obviously, um. There's nowhere else to go, so. Into the weird we go! And, uh, Geronimo and such. Oof. Cool. I, what was that? Was that a bad thing? Yeah, that was a bad thing. I think that's the first time I've actually died dead. And had to restart over. Alright, so not do that. 
But what next, then? I'm not sure. But I'll figure it out, and we'll find out in the next episode. In the meantime, thank you so much for watching this one. If you liked it, let me know by giving that like button a bop. It also lets YouTube know that uh, you're happy with what I do. If you are, that is. And check out some of my other videos. You might enjoy them. Maybe. Sort of. I hope. Maybe. What? I said maybe twice. What is wrong with me? Either way, I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze.